Hi there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So in this video, I'm going to teach you how to fix that Discord not starting on startup. Right now, I have three methods for you to proceed with this one. Let's proceed with the very first one right now. So for the first method, I'm just going to type in on the search bar of my computer, the word run. And once you type that, simply click on the application. So this little thing will show up. Make sure you have this exact code or exact words inside it. So percentage logo, local app data, and another percentage logo. So simply click on OK. And this folder will show up. Now once you're here, since it's already on alphabetically arranged, simply look for Discord. Open it up and choose for application. Once you open that one, you'll see this folder is empty. You just need to go back and then open the second one. And then look for the Discord file, this one right here. Now, for some reason, you're seeing Discord.exe or you don't have the exe same as my end. It's perfectly fine because they're both the same. Once done, simply click on right click. Click on properties right there. And make sure you go on compatibility. Make sure you click on run this program as administrator. So this is the first step. Now, you might click OK right now. So please don't do that. Make sure you click on apply first. So after clicking on apply, click on OK. And you'll be good to go. I'm just going to remove this one because my Discord is perfectly fine. Now that is step one for you. By the way guys, another thing on step one, just click on app data on this option right there and look for roaming. So this are still step one, okay? Make sure this are done accordingly. So look for Discord. There we have it. So this is Discord, right? Simply delete the folder itself. What we're doing right now is clearing the cache giving Discord a little reboot. So we already have it on an administrator, deleted the cache, and basically that's step one. And now for the second step and working this out is same drill, type in the run, open this application, same code, local app data, make sure you have this percentage logo, click on okay, and you'll open this up. Same idea guys, same procedure, go to Discord, and you'll open up this application, right? Look for the update. So for some reason, you're not seeing update specifically. You might be seeing update exe or update discord. They're basically the same thing. Right click on them, go to properties, go to compatibility, click on this option right there. Now make sure it's Windows 8. Now for some reason, you might be asking me or you're asking yourself, how come we're not running this on Windows 10 or 11? The only reason to that is because Windows 8 is the latest version applicable for compatibility adjustment in discord. That might said, it's still applicable for Windows 10 or 11. The only idea here or the only purpose we're trying to achieve is that we just want the latest version available to run on this compatibility. Next up, click on apply and you'll be good to go. So let me just remove that one. So this is not done just yet. We're going to do the same thing on the Discord launcher for Discord application. So open this folder and look for Discord. So once you're there, same process, same drill compatibility at but for this one there is a slight change same process make sure it's windows 8 but make sure this is also running as an admin it's perfectly important or specifically important that the specific of the discord application is running as an admin the one earlier the update it's not really important to run this as an admin but just make sure that this one right here is running as an admin now, for some reason, everything is still not working after doing all those steps and restarting your computer. I only have one final additional tip for you. First thing is going to be this website. It's going to be called Better Discord. By the name itself, it's an upgraded version of Discord, but it's not the official Discord application. It's just a reboot or an upgrade regarding the current one you're using. Simply click on the download button, install it, and then your current Discord will have a little bit of boost. I think this is a mod, if not mistaken. And with that being said, if this is not working, I suggest going to this website. I'm just going to open it right now. This website gives you the option to downgrade. If you remember when's the last time your Discord is working, this is it. Make sure you download the specific date once your Discord is still working. So this is going to be up to down and you can just download discord on this option right here once that's done please restart your computer and let me know in the comments below how it worked out
with that being said thank you so much for watching please hit the like button subscribe i'll catch you guys on the next one goodbye for now